All right, guys. It is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous, and I am talking about seriously over-the-top beautiful day here in the end times in paradise at Bugs in a Jar Farm. It is a just an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous spring day in New York, baby. And uh, I need to uh, get out my planet-saving uh, electric lawnmower and mow the grass, but uh, th these dandelions are just too beautiful to uh, to mow down. I don't understand why people uh, despise dandelions so much. Now, I admit. They are going to turn ugly next week when they go to seed. But uh, we're going to let the dandelions enjoy this beautiful weekend. I'm sure I can find something else to do with my life. I don't believe this damn limb has... <laughs> I have been waiting. I have been waiting three years actually i guess since i bought this place in october of 2019 i have been waiting for this limb to fall off this willow tree so groot came and cut this willow last year before it fell and killed somebody and i thought it would i thought it would live so uh, <laughs> this tree is still alive so we're gonna just let it live there man look at <laughs> look at these dandelions I think I have enough work plenty to occupy me I don't even know what these purple flowers are you know I can't bring a lawnmower out here what do you think little dog what do you think of the bugs in a jar flower garden? So, uh, this is my great greenhouse, which is going to get turned into my tool shed in the garden. This was supposed to be my greenhouse that I was going to survive the winter by coming out here and sitting in the greenhouse. Oh, well, it will make a fine tool shed. So I see bumblebees. All right. Good Lord. We have a flock of bumblebees. They're on these little purple flowers that look like some sort of miniature violet. So the uh, bumblebees look very happy. And there's this little bitty kind of a bee I think it might be, what do you call those little native bees? They're about a third the size of a honeybee. So we've got those little bitty bees, and we got the big fat bumblebees. Do not see a honeybee, but we've got our native pollinators working for us at Bugs in a Jar. All right, it looks like some of my hired help has actually shown up on this spectacularly gorgeous day. So we're gonna get back to work, get out there and get her done while we still can. What do you think of this fine spring day, brother? Oh, man, awesome. What a difference a day makes. Your timing is impeccable. I just finished doing an hour and a half of the <laughs> No, uh, yeah, I am very thankful for the kind loan of that saw. Alright. You ready to go to work? Yeah. Alright, I need a couple of hot dogs to get going. Doesn't get much prettier than this. I can't bear to mow these dandelions. I was going to get out here and mow these dandelions, but they're too pretty to mow down. Burlo? Yep, isn't that, look at that burl on that thing. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah, it's not too bad. Yeah. I've uh, 
Got it. Oh no, I bet my willow burl floated away in the flood. I'll, I'll find them. And that would make one beautiful coffee table to slice that thing. All right. You want me to cut this up?